the vlog. It is a Greece vlog. I cannot believe that we have been able to go on this most amazing trip. This is being filmed after we got back <laughs> because to be honest with you, when we first got there, I just wanted to settle in and just enjoy some time with the family. And then I pretty much forgot to do the intro. So here we are after the event, but we made it there, we made it back. And I can't wait to share with you guys the vlog from Greece. And I just wanna just reiterate because obviously I know how privileged we are to have been able to go on this trip. Uh, I did a whole video on how to budget for this trip and how we managed to save for it and pay for it. It's not something we've ever done before. We absolutely love to travel, but we've never done a resort like this where it's all inclusive and just, to be honest with you, so fancy. Like it was just beautiful. The weather was amazing. The food was insane. The resort was immaculate so yeah i really hope you enjoy the video guys and let me know in the comments if you enjoyed it and if you want to see more travel videos here if you do know my channel you'll know that we prioritize travel over most other things so we will go without the little things to save up for these big things so for us it was just an amazing thing and yeah i love to travel with my little family and show them the world and i just feel so lucky to be able to do that anyway let's get into the video i really hope you guys enjoy it Here we've got a little shop and like little kind of jewelry places and things that sell floaties and things like that but I've heard across the road is actually a lot less expensive it's just literally like a minute across the road and then around this corner there's a really cute little ice cream shop with whatever you want He's going in. He's going in. It's really. Oh, it's chilly. Oh, is it cold? Oh, I can't Daddy stand went up. In. Are you can't stand up? Yeah, just about. My toes can touch the bottom. Daddy went in. Is it cold? No, it's warm. <laughs> it's medium, Dad. It's medium. It's medium. Are you going to go, guys? Yep, I'm going. Henry's going. I'm going to go in. You got this? Hold on, I'll wait at the front for you. Yeah, Daddy's going to have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, I was just about to ask. When we do it, we need to make sure we're not going to go on that big. That's not shut deep enough, I don't think. Yeah. Oh, this bit's chillier. Is it? Weird, yeah. I mean, look how high up. Like, yeah. Massive Three. difference. Ready? Steady. One. Go! Woo! I can do it from here. Actually. It's pretty! <laughs> well done! It's, it's lovely! It's lovely! Yay! Yay! Hey. Was that good? Go on in, head. Go on, head. Yay! Oh, no one's in charge of the boat. <laughs> the boat's off. That was so much fun, and the pedalos are free as well to use. Now we're just going to get some lunch from the buffets. Red green, yum. Oh, mussels, fresh mussels. What else have we got? Pizza station. Yum. Cucumber, good boy. These different salads. What is that? Oh, duck soap. Oh, what's that? Oh, gouda. Oh, gouda. Cheddar, that's cheddar. That's the one we have at home. What's this? White cheese. Oh, that's like a feta. Ooh. Oh, grapes. What's this? Or Look at these puddings. They change every day. Yeah, um, oh, that looks good. What's that? Dark chocolate, pan butter, with chocolate fruit. After lunch, the children wanted to go over to the kids club, so Stu and I had a little bit of time to do some of the free activities, which are really, really fun. My captain. Hey. Where are you taking us? Feels like we're going quite uh, far out. That's the UK. <laughs> Don't know how we're going to get there, though. Just going wherever.
A few times a week they have a show in the place called the theatre, which is an outside area, which is really, really fun. The boys absolutely loved it. They do really nice shows. I'll show you a little bit more about this later, but this was our second night and they had a show and it was really, really good fun. We're back at the buffet for breakfast today. There is so much choice, it's crazy. There's everything you can wish for, different omelette station, pancake station, waffle station, eggs, everything basically. And yeah, basically the hardest thing we had to do each day was decide what to eat. <laughs> and then we're going straight on to lunch because I didn't film the bit in between. You know, it's a french fries would be better. No, it's not good. My, my, um, I'm having chicken nuggets and french fries and my pudding I'm having Oh, they got chocolate pie in it. I don't really want to do it. First, we're going to go to Provence because we haven't been to a sit-down breakfast yet. We've only ever done the buffets, which are really good. Especially if you're in like a rush or your children don't want to sit still for too long because obviously they're wasting time, precious swimming time by being served. But today we're doing Provence, which is a French restaurant, which hopefully will have nice croissants and pastries. And then we're going to take the mini out for a hire today. So this is a bit flashy. Uh, yeah, we're taking the mini out and we were going to do like a boat trip. That's why you're not too keen on that. So I think we might do something around the local harbour. Have a look around, the area, and <coughs> she, grab some lunch, and then we'll be head back here and do a bit of water. Pockets and stuff there, I think. It's yours, baby. Oh, you've eaten it already. On there, it was very... <laughs> uh, it was all right. Yeah, no, it was nice. They did really well. Now on to breakfast too. Mm. This is our ride for the day. Come to a local town called Nikitas. Just having a look for some souvenirs. I'm gonna get our house city something that will thank you. It's really, really hot. You must be so hot. You're so lovely. Yeah. Mm. We have got back from the beach. It was about 45 minutes away. It's nice to get out, but it's definitely nice to be back just because there was nothing there, like no real facilities. We did get um, like a little toasty, which was made with pita bread. We've never had that before. But yeah, we're just back at the pool, having some fun with the children, and then we will be heading out to dinner at Provence, and then we'll be going to the white party. This is a dill or no dill, and I'm not a big fan of dill. This is delish. It's like a kind of co uh, cucumber gin, I think. 
So Stuart somehow has ended up with two starters. <laughs> I have no idea how that's happened. Yeah, that's what my middle name is. I'm going to wait for the masters. It's the only thing yeah. without garlic and onion. Yeah. So we've come to the white party tonight, it's held every Friday night and everyone wears white and it's such a nice event, live music which can't play because of copyright issues uh, but the decoration is gorgeous and the vibe was really nice and sunset and lovely cocktails and the boys had a great time playing in the sand as well. Drinks here, the moms and the dads. Moms and dads. Good morning, good morning. George is leading the way today. We're just heading to get some breakfast from the buffet. And then we're going to head, I think, to the beach. Maybe do the pedlos again. We like that, that was good fun, wasn't it? And what's really nice here is that the sea is not deep at all. So if you fall in or if you want to do the slide and jump in, then you're just like waist height, which is really nice. It's quite overcast today, but it's warm and another day in paradise. Yeah, sorry, Georgie needed the toilet. So we're gonna have some lunch here because yesterday we had to wait quite a while for our lunch. So we just thought, rather than the kids being bored at the restaurant, we'll just let them play in the pool until the last minute and then we'll eat at the pool. And they really want to go to kids club. We haven't booked them in. So we're gonna try and see if we can get them in. But if we can't, then I'm not sure what we'll do. It's just really hot, so I don't like to have them like, in the sunlight the whole day. So yeah, we'll have some fun away from So we've just had a lovely meal over there in Uzo. This little guy is doing sand angels. He's gonna get so much sand in his hair. The sunset is gorgeous, but this black cloud here is not looking so good. But yeah, that was a really nice meal. Uh, they accommodated, because I'm not eating onion and garlic and they've done really well to accommodate that. So that was nice. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go for a few drinks. It was so early to eat there, which I don't know why we had to eat that early because there were no tables taken apart from us and maybe two until about half seven, eight o'clock and we had to eat at half six. So for me, that's way too early. Huh? Oh, thank you, my handsome. So yeah, we've got a little game here to play tonight. Look at this boy. Thank you, bud. What a lovely helper you are, my darling. What? That's actually a fish. Let me see. Wow, that's so cool. It's so delicate, though. It's so delicate. Look after it. Go show the guys. I just absolutely love George's zest for life. Like he 
finds so many things like so exciting and he's like Henry Henry and it just makes my heart sing so much that so he's got that you know like when you live your life through a child's eyes everyone everything's so exciting and amazing and that's what he's like and I just love watching that it's really cool <laughs> my new little obsession caramel latte uh, frozen or ice latte as I say but this has got some sort of delicious looking top to it today got this book on the go as well which is I think called Perfect Neighbour I'm not actually sure what it's called it was on a Let's see if I can find it I never know how to wear this thing it was on a free like I don't know how it works but yeah it's um, on one of the free prime reading This is the deluxe area, I think. Not allowed here. <laughs> Our first meal without the children. How is it? Oh. She's got spaghetti bolognese, not some fries. Baked feta, which would be good if I could have like the onion relish and everything, but I can't. And then the pork zeros without any salad or anything either. So yeah, onion and garlic free is great. Yeah, I think that's both mine. <laughs> Thank you so much. Enjoy your dinner, enjoy your tacos, enjoy your food, please. Thank you very, very much. much. What did you say to Christos? Thank you. Thank you. So we've got some pizza over there. Look at our setting tonight. We're right on the beach. You can actually, you can actually dine down there. There's a supplement to do that. But yeah, you see all the people eating on the beach. You can pizza looks what, so nice. Can you can actually eat your dinner on the beach down there. You see the people with their lights on? That's where we went the first night. It's so nice. And then I've got this. What have we got? Carpa no, not Carpaccio. Um, tartar. Tuna tartar. And Irini, who's been helping with my like awkward food choices without the garlic, um, has recommended this, which is beetroot, asparagus, and I think feta. Like, it's delicious. The sun has come out to join us. A little breakfast date. Itches, bites. We're covered in bites and rashes and all sorts. But it's worth it. This is ginormous. Look at that. I'm not going to leave my eggs after this. This is actually the beach pool. I don't think we've. No. Is it a pool? Huh? No, I think it's the beach pool, I think it's called. But yeah, we've only ever been there once and that was just for the splash pool bit because the, the actual pool, there's not really any shallow bit for George and he gets a little bit worried if he can't touch the bottom. And it's always really, really busy, yeah. This is the little walk back from it. It's so sweet here, like the gardens are always perfectly manicured. Everything is always... I mean, that's probably not that. <laughs> that's just like a cover for the pool. Um, but yeah, it's just so pretty. They've got all these bikes here. So, oh my gosh, it's absolutely loads. <laughs> so I think we're going to go out on a bike ride. Although I didn't realise there were so many here. So I've ordered, like, rented one like that. But these ones might be better. I'm not sure. But yes. That's a really, really good amount of bikes if you want to come out as a family bike ride. There's also these bits here, like table tennis. George is just playing football on this court here, which is like the sand football. He's around there somewhere. Um, but yeah, lots to do. Of course you can. You had momentum. You had the momentum, you just got to keep pedaling. You answered your own question there, don't stop. 
so it's taking a look at me because I couldn't cycle on sand so let's just see how he gets on shall we I'm sure it's going to be super easy for him because you know he's a professional cyclist hurt himself already it does look easy doesn't it it is easy isn't it yeah that's probably what it is than the so Stu mentioned at breakfast that he really liked these like granola yogurty sort of chocolate chip bars. So they've just bought an entire plate up for us to the room. This was meant to be for tomorrow to fly home with, but yeah, he might have to eat them all today. Final buffet. <laughs> Final. Oh my gosh, it yeah, so good. Of selection, we've got braised beef, some sort of potato and courgette, rice, some lovely king prawns, some pork gyro, loads of salad, feta. Just the most random lunch. Ah, there it is the great storm 2022. <laughs> Yeah, that's definitely coming over now. It is coming for us, Bob. Okay, so this guy here, Beach Buddy, he has been amazing. He actually has a piece of, like, string in his hand. And what he's doing, he's going along and putting it behind the beds to make sure they are exactly straight. Like, that is just precise. <laughs> Like how immaculate this place is, is ridiculous. Like everything is just done so well. Like I was just saying to you, like you go to the toilet, everything is like wiped down all the time. There's always fresh tissue. There's always like, it's always just done so nicely. Yeah, really well done him. This guy here, the lifeguard, he was so good with the kids, bringing them all like balls, bringing them to play with. He's going around like sort of doing the towels. Like, basically what's just happened is there was the big storm, which no rain's fallen, but it suddenly got so windy. This is Provence restaurant and I felt so bad. We were sat there and this gust of wind came along and blew every single glass off the table. It was quite scary actually. Um, so they put the shutters down immediately, but all the glasses will be flown. And in fact, a piece of glass flew onto Stuart's chest all the way from there. So basically what's happened is everyone has completely evacuated, but there's not been any rainfall at all. It's just been clouds, but the sea looks like it's a lot choppier. I've never seen it this empty at this time of night. It's about five o'clock. That's where we're going to eat tonight. And Naya cannot wait. I've been looking forward to this all night, all week, the um, Asian food. Even the birds are hiding from the rain. What's happening? Somebody is outside. Oh, that's Yaki, the pool guy. He's really tidying up the place. Even the birds have come in, even though they're frightened of humans. Here you go, baby. Cheers. Cheers. Final drink. Final drink ever. He's getting a little bit here. Close enough. <laughs> Thank you. I've gone for the soft shell crab. You don't like them? Some squid. Oh, I like it, though. Some gyoza. You've gone for the rice. Bit, bit sweet chilli on that bad boy. This is a really, this is a really bad light. It's so beautiful, but this light is not great. So he has been helping me with my intolerances. Very annoying, but you've done such a good job. Every time we sit down, I say, "Sleep, sorry, I've got the bad, the garlic and onion." <laughs> and you have been sorting me out this lovely food. Thanks so much. And um, it's been delicious. It's been so good. Thanks so much. So happy that those tastes of your 
we fill your meals. Yeah, she's been amazing. And your twin brother lives in Manchester, yes. isn't he? So a local girl, a few hundred miles away. <laughs> she does. So yeah, so nice to meet you. And you're in the corner. Amazing. <laughs> With about 50 sleep as we had yeah. before we came out. Not quite as little, but a bit more alcohol. Yeah. A couple too many cocktails yeah. until the wee hours, and then I'll drive off about seven. Keep going, guys. To the back. To the back. End of the Grease vlog, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Do give it a like if you did enjoy it because it just helps other people find it. Helps me gauge if you want to see more travel videos. And it's just a nice thing to do, right? And also subscribe if you're new here. I'd love to have you here in this community. Obviously, I don't usually share such bougie content of all-inclusive holidays, but that's my mantra. Save on the little things to make the big things happen, such as going on lovely holidays and traveling the world. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you so soon. Bye.